every woman's success should be an inspiration to another. In today's video, we will discuss top 10 best women tennis players of all time. On number 10, it's Martina Hingis. The greatest name in female tennis history, Hingis also managed 5 Grand Slam single titles, 9 Grand Slam women's double titles, 1 Grand Slam mixed double title in her career. She also won a Calendaria doubles. Hingis set a series of youngest ever records before ligament injuries. On number 9, it's Justin Hannon. Justin Hannon shocked the tennis world when she retired on the 18th May 2008. She was just 25 and was world number 1. However, in her career, she did enough to creep onto this list. She has won 43 WTA single titles and 7 Grand Slam single titles. On number 8, it's Venus Williams. When Venus Williams first started winning at the WTA level in 1997, many thought that she was well on her way to being the next dominant star. However, there was only one person who would be in her way and never really allowed her to dominate the game. It just so happens that it was her sister Serena who overshadowed her throughout her career. On number 7, it's Billie Jean King. Billie Jean King was already a very accomplished tennis player before she became a worldwide celebrity in 1973. When she was 29 years old, she participated in the Battle of Sexes against a 55-year-old Bobby Riggs. She won 27 Grand Slam titles with different partners. On number 6 is Monica Seles. She was on her way to being a legitimate rival to Steffi Graf. But a stabbing incident in 93 stopped her career temporarily just as she was ascending to the top of the game. There is no doubt that Monica Seles was the most dominant player from 90 to 92. She won 7 of her 9 Grand Slam titles. On number 5 is Chris Ewart. A powerful baseline player, she was the undisputed star of the 70s. Ewart still holds the record for reaching the most Grand Slam single finals with 34 and she managed to win 18. She was involved in a few big rivalries in her career. She also held the title of world number one for seven years. On number four, it's Margaret Court. She won 24 Grand Slam single titles. As a player before and after the Open era began, Court was dominant for Swart Kate. She was the first woman during 70 Open era and the second woman in history to win all four Grand Slam single titles in the same calendar year. On number 3 is Martina Navratilova. Navratilova was ranked number 1 in the world for 332 weeks in singles and 237 weeks in doubles. She is the only player to ever be ranked at the pole position for more than 200 weeks in both fields. She ruled the court like an empress. The champion of 18 singles, 31 doubles and 10 mixed Grand Slam double titles. On number 2, it's Serena Williams, one of the strongest and most powerful women to ever play the game. Serena Williams has certainly left her mark on tennis. Serena has solely dominated the women's tennis for over a decade. Her high level of play over a very long career. Her 23-10 record in Grand Slam finals certainly makes the case convincing. And on number 1, it's Steffi Graf. Steffi Graf does have one achievement that separates her from the pack. In 1988, she became the only tennis player to complete the Golden Slam, winning all four Open tournaments and an Olympic gold medal in the same year. Graf also became just the third woman to complete the Grand Slam. Thank you for watching the video. I hope you like it. Don't forget to like and subscribe our channel.